The security of critical infrastructure, particularly that of power grids, has become a major concern in the era of the Internet of Things. The 2009-2010 Stuxnet worm attack on an Iranian uranium enrichment plant, and the 2015-2016 cyber attack on the power grid in Kiev, Ukraine are examples of the vulnerability of these systems to cyber attacks. Physical and cyber security of smart power grids is challenging due to their complexity and inhomogeneity. A significant portion of the system is connected to the Internet, making it susceptible to remote control. Industrial control systems, ICS, are used in various forms, such as the EMS, SCADA architectures used in power grids. An effective defense mechanism against cyber threats requires a deep understanding of the ICS of the entire power grid. A new perspective on the smart power grid structure is proposed in this article, as well as a modular testbed-like system for modeling cyber attacks, anomaly and intrusion detection. The smart grid, SG, can be deployed in two different ways, as a centralized cloud-based structure or as a modular structure. Each architecture has its own advantages and drawbacks. The centralized model simplifies the complexity of the system, but makes the model unrealistic. In contrast, the layered architecture allows for the analysis of smart grids in a modular way, allowing for examination of the hierarchical structure without removing the complexity of the system. Jim McKenney, an expert on industrial control systems notes that the power grid is supplemented with several IT applications, with computer support playing an important role in grid control automation. Two types of support systems can be distinguished, SCADA, Supervisory Control and Data Acquisition, and EMS, Energy Management System. SCADA is a distributed architecture responsible for data collection and system control, while EMS provides necessary data management and calculations. SCADA systems are key to creating a connection to the whole smart power grid. The integration of SG and SCADA is examined, with SCADA being broken down into five levels. Comparing its structure with the modular SG model, the SCADA components can be classified into SG layers. The SG component layer includes the SCADA physical subsystem and network operation devices. The communication layer contains the protocols and standards used for network connections. The information, data layer consists of cloud-based database structures used for data storage. The function layer includes all calculations, operations, and control logic that control the system. The business layer consists of the human-machine and graphical interfaces at the end systems, used for real-time user intervention.